Hi people, my name is Parker, the creator and developer of Twos, the best place to write things down. And in this video, I'm gonna share some tips that I've found using our new feature called PALS, which stands for Personal Active Lists, AKA lists that do things for you, just by simply writing things down. What is PALS, how does it work? You can find more information about that in a video that I will link above, but you can also find it in the side menu and then go to the Sparkle which will take you to the PALS view, where you can find out questions and answers about it. You can go to the settings for it. You can also see PALS use cases that you can click on any of these cards to start adding or editing a thing. For example, let's click on streaming movies Oppenheimer. I clicked on it, it added Oppenheimer to my day, and it gives you the smart suggestions to the right. And here I can click on where to watch. It's just a really cool way of catching a recommendation from a friend and then wanting to see how good other people think the movie is. Hey, it's a popular movie. It just gives you smart suggestions based on the things that you write down. What is the tip here? If it doesn't get picked up, like let's try Space Jam. All right, that, that got picked up. If it doesn't get picked up, you can write movie or whatever you're looking for, Space Jam movie. Maybe I wanted to find this video, close that window. Family Guy, that won't pick it up. Oh, okay, it picked up Family Guy. But if I wanted the video specifically, maybe I'll do close that video Family Guy video. And this should give me where I can watch it on YouTube. Here's the video. If you just add in one more keyword, there's a restaurant called Steelbach here. Let's see if they pick that up. Oh, Steelbach. So this was Steelbach music, but I wanted Steelbach restaurant. You can just add in a keyword around what you're looking for. And here we are. Maybe we want to book a table for tonight. But yeah, just adding one more keyword. Song, if you're looking for a song name or company, if you're looking for a company, movie, musician, artist, whatever it may be, just adding one more word if it doesn't get picked up. For reminders, we've had this for a while, but now it all goes through pals or goes through these smart suggestions. But if I wanted a reminder, let's say like call grandma tomorrow at 8 p.m. We'll get the smart suggestions here for a reminder, but we'll also get for to do. So you can use any sort of time that you want to have in here. If you write in like weekly or every week or every month, then it will add a recurring reminder, adding those times or those recurring intervals that is also helpful for pals. You can edit your settings. So maybe I want the restaurant, but I never use DoorDash or I never use Uber Eats. You can come into settings, pals, pals settings. You could just go through preferences, pals here. You could actually turn it off if you don't want it whatsoever. You can request a smart suggestion for us. And you also see smart suggestion categories. For example, restaurants. I don't want Uber Eats. I don't want DoorDash. And if I go back to today, I'll actually still see those for existing ones. But if I were to create a new thing, we won't receive those suggestions anymore. If there's one that you want, hit us with a request. Those will go straight to my inbox and I will be working on them. The last thing that can be helpful for us, providing feedback to us. So if you get smart suggestions for something and you like it, there's this little, what was it helpful? Was this helpful? Hit a thumbs up. If you like it, you can share some feedback or just hit done. Tell us why why you liked it or why you didn't like it. If it's not helpful, hit the down arrow. Let us know why you didn't like it or what you would have liked it to be improved about it. That is very helpful for us to continue to improve these smart suggestions, cover more use cases, make sure that everybody's happy. Hi, people. Really quick, thank you for watching till the end of the video. Pals is still in early access, so if you're a new user, you might not have access. But if you use code WELCOME, then you'll have access to Pals. Happy Tuesday. Thank you for watching. Let us know if you have any comments below. Have a happy Tuesday.